what's going on everybody january flowers here your favorite home girl and today we're jumping into the world of baddies east honey if you are new to the channel welcome if you are returning to the channel welcome back to the garden pool yes we have fun around here now y'all know last night episode just premiered the recap is up on the channel get into this tea now as good as last night the girls must watch the shows in real time like we do nice episode biggie saw something that she didn't know in real time and that's the fact that scotty was participating in throwing those water balloons honey yes get into the tea biggie is ready to run up on the original scott y'all get into this clip now shout out to zeus hottest tea biggie said it's up with scotty natalie and roly at this reunion y'all she said say less mind you i seen i seen all them throwing things it's definitely up at the reunion sneaky a girls no i took all of you guys to distract me and still didn't win she said it took all of them to distract her and they still didn't win this is what one of biggie's fans sent her she said at biggie if you watch the recent baddies episode you see scotty natalie and Rooley talking sh and throwing water and balloons at you at this point just sock scotty at the reunion because she has no reason even saying anything she's a whole lap dog now that was biggie response right now y'all know scotty bucked back and y'all natalie gets into the mix y'all gotta get into the seat so that's what biggie put out there say less right child get into scotty response so y'all shout out to reality tv gone bad now this is the thing scotty caught wind of it and spoke up in the comments mind you biggie did an insta story post get into this so this is what scotty said this what y'all want to post just messy i like the song not too much on me now i'm gonna tell y'all what she's talking about so this is what biggie said stop playing with me before i turn up on you so scotty responded girl bye why would I want to fight you over you and Roly and E.T. beef? Like, good night. Now, this is what she posted. She posted the Nicki Minaj song. And the line that she posted said, clean sweep, you getting mopped. That's what she said, right? So, that's when Biggie said the previous post that I just told y'all. Now, look. Reality TV bad had to jump into the mix because they saying, why would you post? Why would you post? This is what they had to say. Real and this is the blog page, y'all. They said, let's not forget, Natalie and Roly beat the out of Scotty. And she still, she said right. so bad that Biggie had did nothing but be nice to her and loyal to Scotty. Because she know what's going on behind the scenes and the Mac too. Mm-hmm. So the song that she posted was called Falling For You. So if you guys have heard Falling For You, I don't know if that's subliminal. I mean, it will be in the realm of Nicki to send a subliminal, but I don't know what that song really represents. I'm still stuck on everybody. Move the beat and you united. Whoa, do, do, do. everybody show off y'all. Yes. So I don't know if this is sneak this or not. So, y'all, they were still going back and forth, back and oh, forth. Shout out to Zeus Network, T Inc. They still going back and forth. Every page then caught a different piece of the conversation. Chill with your homegirl. I'm going to piece it together. Yes. Now, get into this tea. Biggie had this to say. She said, petty fighting. You and your people's word is H. Um, that night, glad you had fun. Now, this is the post that Scotty made. We're going to look at the post with her and DJ Scott. Now, DJ Scott over online trending for a whole nother other reason. DJ Scott trending for a whole nother other. Now, when we get into Scotty post, y'all going to see that T. But this is what Scotty had to say back to Biggie. She said, oh, man, I didn't fight you. I just wanted to have a balloon and nerf fight with everyone that's what she's saying she just want to have a balloon and nerf fight now before we get into scotty post i'm gonna let y'all see what natalie had to say because you see what scotty keeps saying i just was throwing balloons and we had a, a few nerfs get into what um natalie had to say but biggie you did mess the money up that night so we threw some water balloons y'all are so sensitive she did mess up the money though. <clears throat> she was about to get my lick back. <laughs> These girls are crazy. I don't even. I'm not even gonna get into it. What's up, Scarface? What's up, everyone? 
So, of course, Natalie makes sure to wake up and greet Scarface. Just like Biggie said, she is there. What, what she said, step and fetch it of the season. Now, look, for Natalie say it was just water balloons. Natalie, let me pull you and scoop you to the table per usual before we finish getting into the sea. No one's angry. And and this is what I dislike. I have to be honest with, with everyone listening. This is what I dislike about some of y'all fave Natalie. She will pinpoint the smallest thing in a story and say, that's what you're mad over. No one truly mad about the water balloons they are upset at you throwing it during the scuffle if you was throwing water balloons on their own and she wasn't in the midst of a brawl that would have been different okay they just launching water balloons and stuff at her but for all of y'all to target her we still would have felt the way and for scotty to say she was doing that to everyone what we saw on our screen from you and scotty's angle it was biggie who came in last to seeking everyone ended up on y'all side biggie was on the side by herself with scarface stop playing but let's get into scotty's post shout out to baddies t inc so this is scotty's post and let's see what was written that triggered biggie y'all uh, she said the pool party of the century wow the baddies came over nobody left sober it was all because of me i had a blast last night other than them petty fighting new episode of baddies eat is out now scotty almost gives the illusion she's the host of the season i told y'all they say be careful who you mm -hmm. they said natalie's so busy paying attention to them other ones what they say you so busy watching me you don't even see this person standing right beside me yes Shout out to Moni for giving me some big girl advice about Nerf guns. It's seriously going down. It's going down. So Scotty was definitely excited about the Nerf guns and everything like that. Maybe genuinely, she genuinely wanted to, you know, just have a good time or whatever. But it definitely did not happen that way, Scotty. I know you and DJ Sky are the turn up girls of the season, but um i don't know it's just it's just not giving that so i get why biggie was upset at you it's not giving i just wanted to you know have fun with me and my baddie friends so y'all according to the comments scotty is responding to some of the fans she said no i was throwing balloons at everyone i can't help with zoo shows and edits okay is that the only one she commented she commented with this one too this person said they look so good here but baddies, them girls got crater faces with just nice bodies. She says, stop playing with me. Okay, so they talking about her face and stuff. Well, I mean, as far as that goes, what do y'all think? Do y'all think Biggie and Scotty are actually going to carry over this beef to the reunion? Or do you think that by the time the reunion come we probably won't even see this brawl for real because that's what some of these brawls be giving me like they're online going back and forth but that doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to make it to the reunion now scotty and biggie i would not have known about their friendship for real for real if it wasn't for biggie saying that they made a bond off after baddies west now, after all this commotion was going on, some of the other baddies took notice. Tzatziki and Anna Mack hop on live with Biggie. Get into this conversation, y'all. Biggie, we jumping, bitches. Don't worry, Biggie. I thought you was on live going off on the bitches. I don't know if Zeus have done to me, but Zeus, like, I guess I used to, I've always been a fighter, but I stopped fighting for, like, 10 years. And, and now, now brought it like, back out. They bought a monster yeah. though. Like I've never been with like the jumping and stuff until I got jumped. I said know. it's literally no rules. Them bitches were doing whatever they, they wanted all season. Like, we doing whatever we want reunion. They were doing whatever they wanted this season. Bitches can fight in the club, but Biggie can't fight in the club. This is no rules at this point. No rules. And I'm taking my wig off. I'm coming with a glue list, y'all, because I don't want to get embarrassed. <laughs> It's like, do you do you really like how the image is? Don't worry. If anybody want to run up on Anna, I'm slot I'm sliding you. So we can all fight. <coughs> we can all fight. That's, that's what I'm saying. And Biggie as well. If anybody want to fight Biggie, bitch, I'm sliding about sliding. But I don't want. And then let me tell you this. I'm mm -hmm. not saying bitches slide by me because I'm slapping bitches by myself. I don't need no help from nobody. If anybody want to run up on Anna, I'm slot I'm. Sli I feel Anna and Suki about running up because the girls ran a season, so it's time for them to have their season. I agree as well. All these altercations, I don't know which ones are really going to happen, which ones are not. So now we got to the point in a video, yo, where we placing bats. If it came down to it, 
and Roly, I mean, and Biggie and Scotty actually got their one-on-one. Ooh, they kind of like even as far as the hands. I mean, Biggie might be a little bit better, but as far as the height advantage, do y'all see Scotty actually using her height against Biggie? I don't know. I feel like I might got to get that one to Biggie. If Biggie mad enough, she might come out. I haven't seen Scotty scoop anyone. Every brawl I've seen Scotty in, I've never seen her deck anyone or really, you know what I'm saying? I did see her get Anna down in a chair a little bit. But other than that chair situation, mm -mm, I haven't really seen Scotty scoop or sweep anyone. But y'all comment below. Let me know what y'all think about this tea as far as Natalie supposedly jumping in to remedy the situation about us being too sensitive girl please how we being too sensitive child y'all scarface caught wind of what's been going on online and she had this to say mind you she's coping after fresh surgery so this all she had to say little minor talk hey what y'all talking about what y'all talking about i love the fact that i ain't watched the episode but i'm being talked about <laughs> 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 yeah, main character status on. You know, when you don't know what being talked about, you're gonna get talked about. I can tell you that much. Time to get to this real bag then. I mean, that is true. Since E.T.'s entry. I can't take that away from her. Every person has been discussing her since her entry episode. Spill tea. Since she came in, ran up on tea. Spill tea. Y'all gotta give it that. I'm telling you. Now, do I think she'll be the people's champ by the end of the season? No. Even if E.T. does manage to sweep everyone who comes for her this reunion, I still see it being a no only because of the way she was introduced and who she's aligned with. If she comes back for next season, it might be a place of grace for her, you know? Some of the other girls went to Twitter to talk about the bad production from last night's episode. Camila said, I'm honestly disappointed in this season's producers. They need to go back to the drawing board. This season could have been so much more lit. What T said, that's so true. That's so true. Someone's oh, this is um Anna. She was standing up for Camilla. She said, I don't care. Bees keep coming for Camilla. I'm really on that with her. So please, reunion ain't the show. Don't be mad if we both tag that A. I'm jumping bees for my friends. Bees was doing whatever they wanted all season. It's our turn now. FYI, we don't need to preach to y'all. Me and the girls are great. Camilla came back and said, and I tried. while Natalie was talking to the producers, they told me to walk away. I checked on everyone when I witnessed a fight. Everyone got ice for everyone. Stop playing with me. Biggie, no, we had her back, period. Same with T. Okay. Camilla kept going. Camilla be going off. She said, I'm so tired of people saying we should have stuck up for the person or that person. This is the baddie's house. And unfortunately, people came in with their own beef and handled it accordingly. We can't help the editors ain't showing y'all the conversations we had. On BGC, bids was thrown in pools, clothes was ruined, fights happened. Nobody could sleep for real. 24-7 cameras was rolling, was able to bring different people to set and just live like a normal house would. Baddies is like a set. So with baddies, she said it's a set. So they set scenes like they put the objects in, whether it's sponsored mm, objects it's set up. You know what I'm saying? Clothes and shoes. You know what I'm saying? Different technology they're using. So it's set up like a prop scene. Like y'all ever went to, what is it called? Um, the escape room. How do you go to room? The room is propped up. So that's what Camille is comparing it to. A hollow set. You guys gather up and you sit down and talk. Now, if you haven't been communicating all through filming, when you come together, it isn't organic and we notice because they don't live with each other. That's like if all of us live together and they could be like, um, who down there in the kitchen cooking? Oh, Jane. And you, and we see everybody waking up and coming down, eating breakfast and stuff. And I say, how your night turn out and stuff like that because it's filming 24 seven. You see what I'm saying? It's not like y'all wake up, come down to the kitchen, the food magically there. I'm already sitting there. Y'all don't see me cooking nothing. Everything just magically prepared, but y'all only seeing me doing that scene is giving like okay we don't even stay with you you ain't even here you know what i'm saying so i get it all i gotta say is this is a lot <sighs> i mean camilla letting us know it ain't bgc but it's something different she's saying it's something different 
Y'all let me know what y'all think about this tea. The headline is Biggie and Scotty. They acting up, y'all. They acting up. To me, I'm going to go ahead and slide Biggie a couple few dollars. But maybe Scotty with surprises, y'all. Let me know. Y'all comment below and let me know what y'all think. And remember this. Do the best you can with what you got. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.